Sir. Sir. Sir Biden. Biden, hey Kitty. He's on hands on tables and documents and at all meetings and even during the interview. After they see how their children treat animals, maybe it will move someone. Red Cat Biden is allowed everything in the building of the city executive committee and especially in the waiting room and office of the deputy mayor. He's forgiven for mischief and the damaged upholstery on chairs. This is the work of his spouse. Everything needs to be fixed. All doors are open for him. He goes everywhere. He eats everywhere. He walks everywhere. He can go to the city council session as well. Mikhail Lysenko announced his desire to take a pet from the street more than three years ago in social networks. He chose a red kitten among hundreds of others and gave him the name Biden. He settled him in his reception room. Biden has food and drinkers. Here he eats with us. And on this side he has a toilet. The assistant of the deputy mayor takes care of the cat. She feeds and cleans the litter box and in her free time she plays with the cat. She says he won't let you get bored. If something doesn't suit him, he will definitely show his character. He will definitely show it somehow with now or something else. He has a lot of toys. They, however, can now be seen somewhere in the corners, because he rolls them all the time, plays with them. On New Year's Eve, Biden's usually taken home by the owner. There he was already introduced to the rest of pets, to cats and dogs. But Biden did not like the visit of the American bulldog Cheney to his territory. How did someone end up on his territory? Where are his documents? This has not been agreed with the State Department. Visitors are not confused by the red cat. They say on the contrary, he often helps to diffuse the tense atmosphere. It is very positively perceived, even when there is some heat, when there is a serious discussion. I see this small animal, and that's just great. It softens people so much. After the presidential elections in the US, people began to treat Biden even more respectfully, they joke in the city hall. And they began to appeal to him only as sir. Reported by Vadim Kramer and Natalia Husak, UATV News.